Hello everyone, so today is the start of a new series. If you watched my 2017 versus 2018 video that I released on January 1st, you would know that one of the things I wanted to bring to this channel was more book related content as I want to give myself maybe more of a push, more of a reason to why I should keep up reading and what better way I thought than for me to share my current reads with you, some of my books, books I love and books that I want to read, don't want to read, etc. So this video is going to be a little intro video to my books and what I am reading right now. Before we get into the video, if you are new here and haven't already, please consider becoming a part of this magical online family by clicking the subscription button down below. Another side note before I get started is that I'm trying to keep this close to my branding, um, but it is obviously quite different and with the way YouTube is working, it doesn't really make sense to me to create another channel. So hopefully this will work okay as a series, as a set of playlists, just like my kawaii lifestyle and cosplay. So this is one of my bookcases that I own behind me. It was actually gifted to me by my mother-in-law. There are two of these dark wooden bookcases, one on top of the other. Down below I mainly have a lot of stored craft supplies and containers with paintings or something small in front of it to kind of hide the clutter, but I won't really show or talk about those in this video. It might be its own like bookcase tour video. But what I wanted to focus on are the books that I am currently reading and the ones that I plan on reading. I have a Goodreads account that I will link down in the description box. It will show all the books that I've read, all the books that I plan on reading. I keep adding to that list, but there are quite a few on that list right now that I need to get to. And anything that I'm currently reading and I try to keep up to date with the page number that I'm on to see how far along in the book I'm in, as well as since I haven't been able to read for the last several years for pleasure because of university, I've just been so busy, I haven't really read a lot for pleasure. Uh, so my goal of how many books to read through the year on Goodreads is just set to 20. So I'll be doing great if I could read about two books a month and I thought that would be reasonable until, you know, maybe the years go by and I start reading more and more books and joining in maybe some booktube challenges. So I am currently reading the Mortal Instruments series, the Shadowhunter series. I'm going to hopefully get through all of them this year. I have finished City of Bones. I'm now on City of Ashes and so far there are a lot of similarities to like the movie and the show but there are a lot of differences too and I am just being swept up in this amazing magical supernatural world and I can't wait to keep reading. I finished City of Bones within the first week of January. I absolutely love it. I decided to continue on. Um, I got this box set for the Boxing Day sales and it was in my What I Got Boxing Day sale video and I did enjoy this book and what I'm reading so far of City of Ashes that I decided to I decided to also pick up the Infernal Devices, which I have on the shelf above right now. So up top I have the Infernal Devices box set and I have already read a teeny tiny bit of 
Clockwork Angel as I have decided that this is going to be my book read for while I'm at work. I prefer to bring a hardcover book to work with me. I do slide the covers off before I put them in my bag and I do plan on either buying or making a book sleeve. Most likely I'll end up making a book sleeve or two as I have fabric and material and so it wouldn't really cost me anything to make one. But yeah, I've only had a little bit of downtime so far in the work that I've, that I've done so I haven't gotten too far into this book yet but even a few pages in, I'm very intrigued, very interested. I am part of a Facebook group called The Dregs Society. I will leave a link to it down below. It was started by Emma Books, who is one of the first booktubers I think I've taken a liking to and continue to watch here on YouTube. And there's a few others re more recently that I have gotten into, but she created the Facebook page and it is just like overflowing with so many Shadowhunter posts and so I encourage you if you like this series to check that out and you know participate if you'd like to. There are read-alongs happening and some spoilers that should be covered by spoiler and a bunch of like dots and dashes and enters. So hopefully you won't get spoiled if you were to check it out. And I just have this in front right now as well as the Mortal Instruments book that I'm currently reading. I just have on top so that I can easily grab it when I need it. Oftentimes the one I'm currently reading will sit on my side table in my living room or my nightstand in my bedroom if I'm doing some reading before I go to bed. And so far I only have one book for the Dark Artifices which is Lady Midnight. I do want to, you know, complete at least one set of the series. And down below I have books that I have not read yet. Most of them are ones that I plan on reading and I would like to do a separate video going over my bookcase and whether I'm planning on reorganizing it because right now as you can see I have a lot of ones that are kind of categorized for like collectible items. I have like studio Ghibli movies, and I have Pocahontas, Captain Sakura, Sailor Moon, Doctor Who, and some miscellaneous like video games and stuff. But as my book collection grows, I would like to switch this up. I have more books than just this though. I have the Twilight series and the House of Night series and quite a few other books in my Harry Potter cubby under the stairs. I did a whole video on that as well if you're interested, if you're a Harry Potter fan. Um, and so all my Harry Potter stuff and books are for sure in there and I'm not sure if I want to take that away or just leave that solely Harry Potter or have extra books down there. I'm not super positive with some of the rearrangements I want to do. If you have a bookstagram, leave that linked in the comment section or just type out your username. I have converted an old Instagram of mine to mainly bookish type posts, although sometimes I'm a little bit slack with that Instagram, but it's at harajuku.neko. And I, I hope to pick up again. I was sick for a little bit and I kind of slowed down on posts or like I got this new wig and so I was posting a little bit about that or I might have some drawings and stuff, but I would like to organize it better as for a bookstagram account and I would love to know if you have one. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up so that I know that you like this video um, and maybe this type of video. You can also leave a comment down below. I love reading your comments. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye!